Hey everyone, this is Candice from Barefoot and Marigolds and Sweet Peas. And it's one of these nights where I am trying to get stuff done. Who doesn't have to do the same thing as me? If you are a mummy, you always have something on the go and you're doing three, four, five, six things at a time. And yes, right now I have laundry needing to be folded, sitting on the desk, on the bench, beside the stairs. It's been there for two days. And I've been in here for two days. I even got my girlfriend to cook dinner. She doesn't do that very often. It's me. But I'm a little bit busy. And I was thinking to myself, I was trying to take this caulking off of the these windows, was that what I'm doing right now, like I'm building a greenhouse like a 10 by 17 foot greenhouse. It's a little bit crazy. Probably we could go ahead a little bit of a panic attack. So I was like, oh my God, I feel like such an adult. I have this house and I have this nice garden. I've got these really beautiful dogs. And um, now I'm doing this huge thing that may not be huge to other people, but for me, it's gigantic. Like, I'm going to be building something like my little she cave. Ha! Building my little she cave while I'm in my girlfriend's she cave. Because we built this for her. So, it's exciting. I'm excited. I'm a little bit scared sometimes and I'm learning stuff I have no idea how to do and I've learned from people on YouTube how to do these things. So I am here learning this fantastic skill of uh, removing caulking from, <laughs> sorry, um, removing caulking from the window. So here I am. There's a heat gun. Sometimes this stuff just like just chips away pretty look see this was look at that look at that it just goes away it's so old and dry and brittle so I take my uh, my time on most of it um, I seem to just be living in these safety glasses um, so yeah this is my project I have literally learned how to remove caulking and put new caulking back on. If you know me, you grew up with me a long time, you'd be like, wow, that's pretty cool. So I just had this really awesome video with my best friend, Trisha, and like, this is cool. Like we're, I'm learning how to do something that's like super kind of out of the ordinary of my life kind of thing. So I'm excited, but a little bit scared at the same time. So here I am. These are the rest of my windows. These are the rest of my windows. So I still have one, two, three, four, four more to do. You guys, there's four more to do. Five-ish. This one and there's another square one somewhere. Oh, right there. There's the other square one is there that I need to do. And now I feel a little bit stupid because I had taken two windows to the window store to basically do what I'm doing right at this moment and I could have done myself. So I'm gonna enjoy those two windows that I don't have to do because I feel like an idiot. Oops, truth be told. So here I am doing this. It's 10.30 here and in the evening, but I really, 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 really want to get this done. I hope they, that I'll at least have all of them stripped of the paint. All of decocking is done and it's sanded and then it's all cleaned up with linseed oil and then I'm going to uh, start recocking. So that's just that. I'm just learning this new skill that I never would have thought I could do if one of my dreams wasn't coming true right at this moment because I'm still excited to see the end result and kind of everyone else's face when they see it too like the vision in my head is like my art of what goes out there just like what I do in the garden or what other people do in the garden or the pictures that I take on Instagram like those all of those things are like art to me um, so yeah so 
Hooray for those who just jump in two feet, doing things that you never thought that you could do or would even do in your life. An example would be when I was in high school with my best friend, Trisha, who would have thought that I would be here living in Quebec, Canada? Ask Trisha that, she would be like, uh, no, that would be me. It's because I used to copy her French the whole time in, in school. And with that, because where I went to school, we had the quarter system, we could kind of cancel classes and it wouldn't really affect your diploma points. And I graduated half a year early because of the, the, the quarter system, because you do a lot more intense and it's freaky and scary, but it gets done. So yeah, so she would have been like, no, she, she steals all of my work. And then I quit. So then I quit grade 11. Grade 11 is when you need that for like college and stuff like that. And at that time I was like, I'm never going to go to college. What am I going to do in college? And what am I going to do with French? Uh, I don't need to speak French. I hate French. Look where I am in Quebec, Canada. Yep. Quebec, Canada. Very, very far away from where I was born. So here I am in Quebec, Canada. And here I am learning to un un remove the caulking and put new caulking on there. Wish me luck in painting it and making it look beautiful and pretty. The picture that's in my head, I would love for the picture of these windows. I'm not crazy, I'm not crazy. Thanks you guys for joining my adventure and have a great sleep or a great evening or whatever time you're watching this. See you later. Thanks. Bye.